Hello everybody and welcome back to Game Dev Tycoon. Now, uh, last time we made a game that is, uh, has done beyond our imagination. It did so well. We got so much money out of it. And we're, I'm, I'm really happy about it. So now uh, wait, we've generated the game report. Let's see what it says. Dialogue seems to be not that important and graphics seem to be very important. We already had that. Uh, I mean, we're getting better and better at this stuff. Um, so I think we're doing really, really well. Let's do some research. What can we do for research? We can research open world, better dialogues, simple customs, level editor. I think level editor would be would be nice, maybe. Game tutorials, maybe? New topics? What happened to my voice there? Jesus Christ. Hunting. You reckon a hunting simulator would do well? <laughs> we could talk about that later. Um, we're going to go for game tutorials. I'd like some tutorials in there. That would be nice. Uh, we spent some money on that, but again, uh, there's no no way we can ever... Look at it. We can we can waste this money. We've got three million in the bank, which is fine. Now, of course, who uh, we got Warfly who did exceptionally well, making like uh, two point eight million. Now we of course uh, who did it who wasn't or me that good. And Flight Simulator two was quite nice, but Warfly was the best. And two uh, the TES will be taken off the market. Okay, oh that's a shame. That's a bummer. New office. You've made quite a name for yourself and um, have saved up a lot of capital. If you want to grow the company further, then moving into a new office is the next step. I found the perfect office situated in... You know what? Fucking let's do it. Let's go to a new office. This is beautiful. <laughs> I'm just in this big ass office all by myself. Welcome to your new office. But now that you have a big office, you can also hire staff. Oh, there we go. And forge world class development team to make even better games. You may now also train yourself and your staff to improve skills. Let's try this by completing a management course, which is required before you can hire your first employee. To get started, close this matches and click anything on the character to bring up the extra main. Okay. I can train him. In staff management. Okay. Game for pirates. Don't repeat yourself. Coding complete. Okay. Book studies. Uh, sure. We'll, we'll check it out later. I promise. Um... Wow, this is quite the office, isn't it? Jesus Christ, that's cool. Okay, we're gonna develop a new game actually. Um, we're gonna go, we're gonna go make Warfly 2. Maybe it will be as good as Warfly 1. I mean, it can only disappoint basically, but we're just gonna try. Um, and I think this this game was for mature. Uh, we're gonna go with the sound engine, I suppose. Like, wait, wait a second. If we can create a new a custom engine with the game tutorials. Monos, uh, okay, with all these things, and the save game, it's, it's gonna cost me 100k, and it's gonna be called um, the Noob Engine. It's it's the Noob Engine, oh, Engine 1. It's our first engine, it's cost me 100k. Um, oh, we've got a lot of monthly costs now, Jesus, it's actually really gone up. Okay, so now we're creating a really nice engine, uh, which we can use in uh, basically all our games. The Noob Games Inc., look at that, that looks cool. We've got, a, we even got like some sort of password we gotta give in to gate to get in this thing okay, noob engine one is complete let's create a game with that okay so um the topic i think it was the topic is gonna be airplane simulator which is really really nice we're working together uh we're gonna create it on pc uh it did a, it did the best for mature so we're gonna go for mature in here too uh pick game uh we're gonna go with the noob engine and we're gonna go to warfly 2 warfly 2 of course now with new uh improved engines and all that TES is no longer supported. Okay, now we know that. Thank you. There you go. We're creating a. New it's not. It's not. It's not going off that well. The engine, the game, the story in Quest is to be a bit less. It's. It's. It's up there. But there you go. Hopefully, we can get some good points for this one. We won't break any records probably, but I mean, it would be nice if we still get some nice points. Uh, dialogue seems to be not at all important. Artificial intelligence seems to be very important. Let's all design. There we go. Let's keep up with that. Let's uh, let's let's do some marketing. Let's uh, I mean, we can now spend some more money on these things, magazines and demos. Let's do that. Look, we've got a hype of ten, with two and a half million. Uh, these two have really improved the, the the thing. We'll design a bit less. So let's just go for that. Look at that, thirteen hype. Oh, the hype is real on this one. Let's hope it will deliver. Let's hope we will we we're able to deliver. Let's debug this game, and then finish it. There you go, seventeen hype. It's 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 more than we've ever had. We've got a new record. That's cool. Oh, we did well. Let's hope that this game will do as well as we as, as the previous one did, because that would be awesome. Or it may be even better. Just make us another million or so. That'll be really nice. Release the game. Okay, here we go. The reviews. 
Please don't disappoint me. A seven. Not what we hoped for. I mean, I... Oh, and a five. This game disappoints a bit, doesn't it? Disappointment. I like it. I wonder where we, got, where we, where we went wrong, though. They should focus more on the technology. Oh. Um, this sucks. How would the sales do, though? Because we got quite a lot of hype. This is not the game that we hoped we would create. It's still selling pretty decently. Um, but it's... It's not what we wanted to. It's not how we wanted it to work. It's not the, the, It's not great. It's really. It really isn't. Um, I wonder where we got wrong. I want to see this. Because honestly, where did we go wrong? I don't know. We're still gaining fans. And we're still selling this game. But it's not nearly as impressive as it was. And that's a, that's a real shame because we spent a lot of money on this one. But where did we go wrong? Engine seems to be quite important. Level design seems to be quite important. Okay, so we did well, but maybe we can tweak a couple of things. That's what we that, that, that's what we went wrong. Well, maybe we can find some construct work and get some easy money in. Uh, that's what we probably need right now, because we're not making like an awful lot of money from it. I mean, we still have some cash, but we don't. I mean, the monthly costs of this new office are like very, very, very high. So we really, we really don't want to waste that. I was, I had high hopes for this one, but we didn't, we didn't deliver in the end, which I really, really, really think is a shame. Can we able to, are we able to pull this off? Uh, none of these weird encryptions, but I do not understand. This is a very special offer. Our agent to gain some... No. No. No, it's not going to happen. Will we be able to pull this one off? Yeah, we really need to make a new game because we're... Oh, oh this is going to be a tough one. It just... It, isn't, it didn't do well. Which I think it's... We're just about... Oh, close, close. We just did it. Oh, that's nice. Okay, cool. Research point, we're doing good on research point. Um, let's um, do some... Oh, I need to click on myself now, obviously. I need to... Uh, okay, research. New topic. You know what? Let's just go for hunting. Let's just do it. Let's just fucking do it, okay? We're just gonna make a hunting game. The simulators have, 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 have proved us to do well. But this time, we might do something else. We might go for an open world hunting game. For mature, maybe? I don't know. Again, it's easy to get back on these simulation games because now I know how they work. And I said that, but the last time did it didn't really went that well. So let's do some trading. Here we go. God, we're wasting a lot of money on this. We don't even see that because we still have 2.6 million. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna see how, how it goes. We can spend some money on things, that's good. Uh, but I was hoping the the game the, the, the World of Light 2 would be great. But again, as all, almost all uh, prequels, uh, sequels, we fucked it up. Well done. You successfully completed your management course and you are now able to hire your very first employee. Employee, To get started, just click on fill position button. Okay, we've got a position. Before you can hire someone, you have to advertise to open a position. An advertising budget and decide how you want to test your... Okay. A high budget will increase the number of... Okay, yeah. Of apply of, ap of appliance and the difference test will help find people with the right balance and design technology skills. I don't think you want any of those. Yet. Yeah, we don't need you. We'll do it on our own. It's fine. We don't need you. Okay, we can, if you want to create hit games and have a world-class team, then training is important. For the best results, train yourself regularly, but don't overwhelm them in too many sessions at once. There are different training options available. Some options are better to increase certain skills than others. Experimenting is the best way to figure out which training options fit your plans. If it's... If it... If it... If... Uh, it is successful to have a mix of specialists and all-rounders in your team, but aim to have at least one design specialist and technology specialist. Okay. Um, I we all don't know, we don't know what these effects do. Game design for pirates, game dev gems. Um, I, I I I don't know. Let's let's start training. Let's see what this does for us. We can spend some money on it and see how it works. You doing some training now? I suppose. I probably need to wait. They got plus one on some things here. Okay, so we're gaining some things from this. How long, is it, how long will this take, though? My strong audience is young. Okay, I would like to... Ooh. To extend this formal invitation to participate in the biggest game convention on the planet. Games, games, games. Also known as G3. By having your own company booth at G3, you can gain a lot of fans and hype for your games. And we think our audience would love to see you there. That is nice. How do we How do we do that? Okay, just wait for him to be done with his training. 
The giant technology is get, getting some boost here. Okay. Um, so now what? Um, okay. Develop a new game. We so we're, we're gonna do this. We're gonna we're gonna go for a young. We need to get some some. Oh, I don't know. We need to get. Okay, we're gonna go for hunting. I I don't know, man. What do we want? Maybe sci-fi action for young. I don't know. Let's let's try. Let's try. Uh, RPG. We all don't know how this does on it. You know what? We're gonna go for a um for a, for an, someone that almost everyone has the Vina gear. How is uh, audience match? Audience match. We don't know about the audiences of all these things. We're gonna go for the Vina Oasis because I like it. Yeah, yeah, we want to do that. Okay, uh, pick a game engine, the noob engine. There we go. We're going to call it a, a, a Galaxy Battle 2. Or so, no, just Galax Galaxy Battle. Let's see how it does. Uh, it's a bit of a risk, but we can waste some money on it. Again, I don't know how all, any of this works now. Uh, probably uh, engine a bit less important, story quest a bit more. I honestly don't know. We want a linear story, save games, and game tutorials. We want to have them in... We have, oh, there we go. We're getting quite some points here, actually. Which is nice. Okay. Dialogues. Uh, artificial intelligence seems to be important for this one. Uh, dialogues, we don't know. So we don't want to do it going at too low. Level design. Level design is important on this one. There you go. Let's hope, we will do more. Let's hope this will be a smasher of a game. It'd be really nice to promote and sell this game on the G3 conference. Uh, world design is way, way more important. Sound, graphics maybe a bit less. Uh, you know what, we're gonna go for it. See how we go. Um, let's let's create some uh, marketing hype. Uh, just some small hype. Hype is 7, 8, there we go. 9, doing well. Finish, debug the game and then finish it. There we go, can't waste too much time on this. Debug it. There you go, debugged it, and finished this game. We've, I think we've got records. I think we did really well on this one. It's ready. New records on both. Awesome! There you go. Now hopefully this game will do well. Now, now hope it, do, it will do well. I hope it will, because we, I really tried my hardest on this game. I really, my, I mean, I really, I think this would be good. I mean, it's a risk because I don't know the combinations of all of this. The game convention. Uh, a medium booth or a large booth, because we 1.5 million. We're a smaller company. We just do a common setup for 80k. The first refusal come in. Yeah, we fucked it up. We fucked it up. At least we got a 6 from Informed Gamer. A 4 from Game Hero. They always dislike me, fucking Game Hero. Again, nope, we didn't do it. I don't know where we will, where we go wrong with these games. Like, I try my hardest, but I don't know what is go- What- Where do we go wrong? Well, at least we can try now. At least we can see where we did go wrong. Okay, I wanna know. It's becoming difficult now to please my audience. There you go, we're already running behind in sales now. Okay, where did we go wrong? Let's see. It's a great combination. Gameplay seems to be important. I think we went- We went full a lot on both though. Okay, we've got- Look. The invention. Oh, there's quite some people there. Oh, look. Oh, man. oh this, this is amazing. Lots of people seem to be interested. We got almost... We got... Oh, a decent amount of people at our... At our conferences. Once... We gain more... Fa yeah, we're a small company. We, we're not... I mean, it's not that... It's not that... It, it doesn't go that quick. You know what? Let's just go back to our rules. Let's just make another airplane simulator ga simulation game. Let's just fucking do it. We know it, it. We know it went well. We know it does really, really good. We're gonna make it for everyone because it just works. Uh, Warfly Three will come back better than ever. Warfly Three uh, on the um, on the sound engine as we did previously. Pro no, we're gonna go for the noob. Uh, there you go, the, the noob engine one, and just and just see where we're gonna tweak it a bit and change it a bit. We need to make sure this one works. There you go. Engine seems to be important. Story quests, uh, less. We're gonna go with all this. Gameplay seems to be important. There you go. I think this was, this was how it was, right? I think it was. Don't know. Can't remember. Today, Vani has announced their own console. It's called the Play System. 
Wow. <laughs> Apparently the company has co completely reworked their earlier PlaySystem prototype after an Invento ca cancelled the project. Okay. The new PlaySystem comes with the CD-ROM drive and... Okay. A lot of things. It will enter the market in two months. Fair enough. Okay, the hype is in two now. Uh, sequels. We need that. That's what we need. Because then we can actually actually make sequels. Dialogues, not important at all. Level design, artificial intelligence, really important. Just gonna go all out and do it like this. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> the hype is on four or five. Without even, without even using any sort of marketing. Okay. Graphics and sound seem to be really, really important. World design, less. Uh, which I don't really agree with. Um, but hey, it's what, this, what the game says it is. It's true. So we're just gonna believe it. We're just gonna go for a bit of small marketing to get the hype up a, a, a bit. Please tell me this game is gonna work. Maybe we're gonna get some records here. We actually did get some records here. Okay, it has the the play, it has released. Finish it, finish it, finish it. Hype on seventeen. It did really well. We did what the, the previous one didn't do that well. Maybe this one will. I think we got two records on this. There we go. New records and everything. And now hopefully we also made the right choices here. To see that this game actually works really really well. I hope so. I really do. This is the last thing we're gonna do this episode. After these reviews, we're gonna we're gonna go. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. We need this. We need this to do well. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. It's not maybe a ten. A ten? No, it's gonna go for a nine. Again, really good. A ten. A ten. Bets of the sky. There we go. We're back to our winning ways. Amazing. And this is an eight. Uh, it's not it's not as good as the previous one, but I think this one will still do very well. How will it do in sales? It's not it's not that impressive actually. Compared to the pre to the previous game. It works. I don't get me wrong, it still works. But it's not as impressive as the previous one. That's a shame. There we go. Very positive news. Gave it a 10 saying best of its kind. Okay, let's see how we let's see how it goes now. We we made some nice sales with this. It's not it's not that great, but we still made some money off it, and um, we're still making some money off it. The market is normalized again, with no particular strong trends at the moment. Okay, and that's where I'm gonna leave you, everybody. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure to slap that like button. Whatever object is within your reach, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Welcome to the family, and thank you guys so much for your support. And then I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.